So Marathon Industries, give me a breakdown. It's a B2B company that provides uh, cloud storage for Fortune 500 companies. Chet, what did the market research turn up? What? Oh, I Googled them, but the results were weird. You didn't use the market research database that we spent thousands of dollars a month on and that you were specifically trained to use. I quit. This job is different than I thought it would be. Stop. Does this situation look familiar? A new type of worker has entered the workforce. They're called millennials, and they're terrible. Today, I'm going to teach you all about this new breed of worker so you can avoid misunderstandings in which you feel the need to fire them immediately. In the first reimagination we just saw, Mary makes the classic mistake of not reassuring Chet while offering overflowing amounts of praise. Chet, you were so smart to use Google. That's the perfect way to start the research. You're so smart. Great job. So the uh, conference call is scheduled for 10.30. So that we're on the same page, let's do a pre-call about 9.30 a.m. I don't understand. No noodle, no. noodles. Nine no more, no, no, nine thirty. Cheryl Sandberg here isn't aware time exists before 10.30 a.m. To her generation, there's a mysterious dead zone after 4 a.m. and before they stroll into work 40 minutes late with their iced coffee. So take that into consideration for scheduling. That's very difficult for me. Fine, I'll, I'll take the call myself. Oh, thank you. Nailed it. Here's that report that you asked for. Oh. Thanks. Morgan did exactly what was asked of her. Nothing more, nothing less. She expects a raise and promotion. Thanks. Junior Executive Manager of Data Consulting. Is that better than Assistant Manager of Junior Accounts? Yes. Oh my god, thank you. I'm gonna go call my parents. Now you're getting it. I need to take work off tomorrow for a mental health day. Did you know millennials can actually be exceptionally creative with reasons why they need to miss work? These eccentric excuses are normal to them, and they will be to you, too. Sure, that's a normal thing. Hi, um, I know I only get 10 days paid vacation, but that wouldn't count a three-week Argentinian surf spirit quest, right? No, why would it? Oh. Ugh. Why don't you go home early today? That's it. Any questions? Why even hire millennials? Oh, right. Well, millennials comprise 19% of the workforce. If none of them worked and their parents supported them, it would cripple our economy and China would take over. So unfortunately, it's your civic duty to employ them. Trust us, we want to fire them all too, but we can't. 